So guys, a wonderful good morning here from London Heathrow. And once again, today I'm gonna to show you how to make the most of your time here at Europe's busiest airport. So I'm gonna share with you a few tips and tricks how to make your time at Heathrow today, especially on at Terminal 2, more fun and valuable. So let's go to the airport and find out. Great thing about Heathrow, it's very easy to reach. You can either take the iconic Piccadilly line, which you can easily access with your Payway bank card, by the way, or you can take the much faster Heathrow Express from Paddington Station. The train takes around 15 minutes or cost you 22 British pounds. Today's trip would take me to Singapore, departing from Terminal 2, or also known as the Queen's Terminal, which opened in 2014, and it's home to mostly airlines of the Star Alliance, such as Air Canada, Turkish Airlines, or Lufthansa. Terminal 2 is also powered by 124 solar panels on its rooftop, making it one of the world's most environmentally friendly terminals. So did you just see the water station? So at Terminal 2, and I think at most other terminals here at Heathrow, they have drinking stations everywhere where you can uh, refill uh, your water bottle, which I think is always a very nice, uh, very nice service. But now because we're entering the Christmas season and you can see um, the big Christmas tree right there, there's another one down there. Um, we all tend to try to get our Christmas shopping done and now I'm going to show you how you can do that in a very smart and efficient way. I know when we come to the airport we usually rush, we get busy, we don't have much time but with the Heathrow app uh, which you can download from the App Store um, you can like pre-order, pre-purchase um, whatever good you want and then you can literally pick it up um, at any store here. So I think most of the stores participating in that program and now I'm going to show you how it works and uh, let's see, we're going to buy something and we're going to pick it up at the store. Um, uh, very curious to see how functional this app is. But if it works, I'm sure it's going to be a great asset and it's going to be, uh, going to be very helpful and makes your travel stress free here at Heathrow. So yeah, let's try it out. So also Heathrow has among the fastest public Wi-Fi um, of any airports around the world. And I've just done a speed test and as you can see, um, the download speed is at 200 megabytes per second uh, right now. So let's say I have to upload a video. Um, I can do that in like literally a seconds. And this is the upload speed. It's climbing right now. When I did the test earlier, it was at 100 megabytes um, per second. Not even at co-working spaces, you get such fast internet. And it's free, you don't have to like sign up. You just connect with your phone to the Wi-Fi and there you go. So and if you happen to be a freaking visitor to Heathrow, just like me, you should get the Heathrow Rewards card in order to collect and redeem miles at over 400 retailers and over 70 bars and restaurants. They can also be converted to Avios miles of British Airways. So and there we go, this is the app and uh, I go to our shops and then I select the terminal I'm at. Right now I'm at the Queen's terminal number two and then it's going to ask me before or after security. Since I already cl uh, cleared security, um, I'm going to go for after and then let's see uh, the two stores they have. One in the departure lounge and one at gate B35. See so reserve and collect. There we go. It shows you a list with um, all the products so you can show more products. But then, for example, you click on it and then you can um, just purchase it with the app. For example, when you are on your way to the airport and you know that you wanna get some shopping done but you don't have the time, so you just use the app. Uh, it's very easy to navigate as well. Uh, so you can find the terminal and it also shows a map. So if you see 
if you don't know exactly where the store is located, you can also find it on the map. Also, Google Maps uh, teamed up with London Heathrow. So you have uh, one you go once you go to Heathrow Airport on Google Maps, you can see a detailed plan or a detailed map of the airport so you don't actually need uh, the app to navigate you you can because it has a map as well but you can also use um, google maps which makes your life so much easier but also if you have a longer transit here at Heathrow um, you're welcome to use the plaza premium lounge in exchange for a little fee so let's head there and let's see what they have to offer So in Terminal 2 also features uh, Plaza Premium Lounge, which is pretty much the lounge you can use in your Priority Pass on your Amex. And uh, if you just want to pay cash, you pay £40 and then you can use the lounge for two hours, including the spa, the buffet and everything that's included. So let's have a look inside. Premium Plaza Lounge made a very nice and clean impression and is open from 5 to 10 every day. It features a bar, a buffet, free Wi-Fi as well as a business center. Also the shower and the day rooms can be booked separately on the website. So for additional charge you can also get a massage here. And you can get, if you want, you can get uh, your nails done here as well. So and then it also features those uh, day rooms or hourly rooms. Um, I think it starts from 60 pounds for like three hours. And then uh, they have double, and this is a single bed here. Um, comes with a shower, a sink, a toilet. So if you want to have a quick nap in between flights, you have a transit or whatever, and you really need a proper bed to sleep, for example, I need a good bed to have a good sleep, then uh, you can also use the service here at uh, the Premium Plaza Lounge. And which is also really cool is um, Terminal 2 is home to some really nice restaurants. Uh, you can get sushi here, uh, original British food, um, as well as here the Perfectionist Cafe, which does uh, proper pizza in an oven. Uh, they had to get a special permission for that, which is uh, also quite nice. And uh, yeah, so this app doesn't only work for uh, duty-free items or whatever, but you can also pre-order uh, your food, for example. If you want to have a bit of sushi, you go on the app, uh, the same, you pick out the restaurant, and then you, on your way to your gate, you quickly grab it. Uh, it's funny because they work together with Grab on this app. Grab is a very popular app in Asia, which I use all the time, and they teamed up with Heathrow in order to make your life so much easier. But yeah, just get your food um, on the way. Um, no waiting times, no queues. And once again, that makes your journey here at Heathrow so much easier. So and while I get prepared now for my 14 hour flight to Singapore, please let me know in the comment section below what you think of London Heathrow. Do you have any tips and tricks here how to make your journey easier? Let us know in the comment section below. Um, I really want to know. And also let me know what do you think, which airport um, is the most convenient for you? Which one has a great app, great Wi-Fi, great facilities? Um, that's what I love about Heathrow. You, there's everything. You get literally um, anything here and it's very easy um, and uh, passenger friendly. Um, well guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, yeah, let me know in the comment section below. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet and um, wherever you're off to, have a great trip. And I'm off to Singapore now. See you guys, thanks for watching.